What's up guys, Skyzerker here with the next episode of ESO Grimoire, and we're in part 6. So, we are headed to the Blue Palace, right over here. Let's see, we're gonna go talk to Gerhild, and yeah, it's gonna be pretty epic. Alright, this, mm, this place Fascinating is... Fascinating application of the technique. Into here... Yep, I think hey, I found her. Assassins in the palace! Help! That's one of the queen's attendants. Uh -oh. Let's get inside. Uh-oh. Something something fishy going on. Hmm. Something very fishy. <gasps> Is it delicious? Fish tastes pretty good, but uh-oh. What's this? Be strong, Svana. Mother! Svana, your father, the kingdom, watch over the mother. No, you can't die, mother. Sire, the assassins might return. You must get to somewhere safe. <laughs> Have Joran's lackeys come to gloat? We came here to warn you, your highness. And yet my wife lies dead. If you had listened to us, like she did. If I determine Joran had a hand in this, there will be war! Someone take care of my wife! Father, That guy, please. Dome. Sure, listen. And now, she got the oof because of it. That guy has the same armor as me, though. It's pretty good. Gods, what a disaster. The Queen's been assassinated and Svargrim still refuses to listen to reason. We need to find a way to set things right. How did Assassin get that close to the Queen? Good question. Guards should have been able to handle a run of the mill assassin. This could be connected to the Ice Reach Coven. In fact, I'd wager my axe that it is. Dang, that's a pretty big wager. Well, what do you want to do now? Look around. See if you can find any indication of how the assassin got in and out of the palace so easily. Maybe even turn up something that ties the murderer to the coven. I'll make sure the princess is all right. All right, I'll see what I can find. Let's, let's look around. Shattered glass. Ooh, there's a medallion from the Ice Reach Coven. Pretty, there's some evidence right there. Svana's taking this pretty hard. I suppose most daughters feel close to their mothers. Not that I'd know, I never knew my mother. Sorry, don't mind me. Did you find anything that might lead us to the assassin? I found this medallion. We've seen these medallions before. On the Reachman near Kilkreath. And I saw them on the witches in Ice Reach. The assassin definitely seems to be in league with the coven. But can we get Svargrim to believe that and accept the danger he's in? He seemed pretty angry to me. Svargrim has every right to be angry. He watched his wife die right before his eyes. But he's the High King. He doesn't have the right to be stupid. Mm -hmm. Time to make Svargrim confront some hard truths. Come on, the sword thane led the king upstairs. That's right, a wise ruler needs to let... Needs to follow reason over emotions. There are times for emotions, but bang. We need to see the High King. I should think not. The High King is in mourning. He's not to be disturbed. The Queen's wasn't the only life lost today. Now get out of our way. That armor, though. I uh, go right in. Your Highness, please. Your kingdom is in grave danger. My queen's blood hasn't yet cooled, and already Joran's lackeys hound me. We have proof that the coven threatening your kingdom is responsible for the queen's death. Show him, partner. Does Joran think me so weak that he believes his half-giant can twist my arm and fill my head with lies? Listen. I am not so easily duped, outsider. Um, I think not. It's not your you should be concerned with. It's the Ice Reach Coven. Reach witches? They pose no threat. Dumb. We've beaten back those wild dogs time and time again. Fell our brothers to the east. Bow down to a poetry writing milk drinker. Hey, poetry's pretty cool. I will not be lectured on such matters by the likes of you. You heard about that hero storm? <laughs> it turned her people into hero fiends, brother. Tales told around campfires to scare the children. 
Storms happen here all the time, and none of them spawn monsters. The last spy who spoke of such things, well, he no longer speaks of such things. I am the Wolf of Solitude. I know my enemies. More like the dumbass of Solitude. Well, Queen asked us to bring you proof. That might be what the coven oofter. You dishonor my wife's name by letting it pass through your treacherous lips. Away with you! And pray I don't find evidence that ties you to the Queen's murder. That would not go so well for you. Oh, well, you're just gonna be we'll leave you to your grief, your highness. Dang. Dump. Got any books? Guide to Western Skyrim. Interesting. Mm. You know what? I don't like you. What do you got? Got a Morin tablet. Ooh, got a lead. Companion's coronet. Look at that. Delicious. You could. Mm, okay, cool. That was worth it. Okay. Wait, is there any an another lead? Let's see. Let's see if we can get some here. Oh, I'm curious. I don't need those. All right. Yeah, serves you right. Being dumb. That's what happens. Deserved it. All right. Is it true? Mother told me you were working for her before she. I'm sorry, Svana. I would have saved her if I could. My mother. She told me she gave the mighty Lyris Titanborn an important task. Tell me, what were you doing for my mother? We're getting evidence to convince the High King of the threat to your kingdom. Threat? What threat? And do you think this is why someone came into the palace and killed her? The Ice Reach Coven did it. Now they hear, and they stay Did you tell my father all this? Is he rallying the soldiers? Alerting the other holds? He's dumb and won't listen. He thinks it's all some plot from the Scald King. <sighs> My father sees Joran's plots everywhere, even in his spicy venison stew. <laughs> Dean Goldberg! I won't let my mother's death be for nothing. She trusted you, and so will I. My father be damned. Please, find whoever did this and stop them. We'll do what we can, your highness. I saw the assassin. He moved fast. Unbelievably fast. He leaped through the window after stabbing my mother. By that time, the guards had gathered, so I guess he decided to flee. Try to follow his trail. Someone outside must have seen something. She get a good he look. was fast, that's for certain. Here and gone before the guards could even draw their swords. Other than that, I didn't get a good look. The inside of his hood was nothing but shadows. Ooh, spooky. You tell the High King he might listen to you? My father? Listen to me? When horkers fly, maybe. But probably not even then. He gave up on me a long time ago. I'm sorry. Oh. I'm not my mother. Never will be. But I swear I'll do whatever I can to help you. You have my word on that. Alright, cool. You can be alright? No. My mother. The last time we spoke, I hurled a mug at her. Oof. But I came Oof. when she summoned me. Just in time to see her murdered. Stop crying. I... I need to pull myself together. She asked me to watch over my father. The kingdom. I can't let her down. All right, let's go. Let's go figure out this plot. Come on, let's princess. See. Let's get you somewhere safe. Don't call me princess. Oof. Just Svana. There's nothing noble about me. <laughs> she pouty. <laughs> Dang. All right. Find a witness who saw the assassin. Let's do it. Alright, let's go back to Solitude then. Well? Um... Tisfold. <laughs> My wife. She is like ice. So cold. So pale. <laughs> All the warmth sucked out of her. Oof, what happened? There was a commotion at the palace. Everyone was headed that way. Except one man. No. Not a man. He wore an eye patch, but his face was bestial. He dragged her along like a bone between a dog's teeth. Then he tossed her aside, pale as snow. Ooh, dang, where'd he go? He was fast, so fast, ran to the Hall of the Dead. He never even looked back at what he had done. All right. Well, 
Hall of the Dead. Let's go. Let's go. Find a witness at the Hall of the Dead. Epic. Let's make sure. Very cool. Very nice. Going. We zoom in over here. High Priest Ingert. Let's see what he has to say. Will you pray with me for these poor souls? Cut down and bound for the Hall of the Dead much too soon. Tell me what happened. It was a monster. A vampire. I have seen such creatures before, but this one wore an eye patch. Ooh. It moved like a shadow and took sustenance from these poor souls. Delicious. I called upon Arke's grace, and the vampire fled before his sacred presence. Which way did the vampire go? Toward the main gate. I pray the guard finished off the depraved creature before it took another innocent life. All right. Going to the main gate. Find a witness. Let's zoom. What is it? In this town, though, this, they did a really good job recreating Solitude, I think. It's just This place looks beautiful. Look at that. Shield Corporal Deal. You again? Didn't I warn you about putting your nose where it doesn't belong? Priest said a vampire was over here. What happened? A vampire? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. But whoever it was tore out Sonolia's throat <laughs> and fled through the gate before I could stop him. What do you know about all this? And why is it any of your business? He doesn't know we we're talking about a vampire, but it tore out her throat. Okay. I guess just regular people just go around doing that. Well, the vampire assassinated the queen, so... The queen's dead? Yup. What about the High King? He'll have my head for letting the assassin slip away. Your head's probably the least of your worries when the High King hears about this. I don't like you. You you think would the High King really But I'm a loyal subject? No more talk. I need to get Sonolia off the street. Alright. This is Spargrim's fault. He should have heeded us from the start. Should have. Damn Svargrim and his distrust of Yorin. How many more of his people have to die before he accepts the truth and lets us help him? Forget that for now. Tell me about the assassin. Did anyone get a good look at the murderer? The assassin killed more people as he fled the city gate. A priest identified him as a vampire. That would explain the assassin's swiftness and ability to escape so easily. Mm -hmm. We knew the Ice Reach Coven had vampires on their side, but using them so blatantly. Anything else to report? The assassin was a vampire, you wore an eye patch and escape. Well then, time to fight fire with fire. They've got evil vampires and we've got a friendly one. <laughs> Let's find out exactly what your friend Fen knows about vampire clans in the area. Where did you tell me Fen was going again? Fenorian. He said he was going to see a clever woman near Morthal. Right. To research the ritual. Go find them and see what you can learn. I'll stay with Savannah. Bring her up to speed on everything we've uncovered. We're going to need her to get the High King to trust us. And I'm calling him Fen. It's simple. <laughs> Alright, Fen it is. I'll find him, see if he could help track down Queen Gerhild's assassin. Alright, guys. That's it for this episode. <laughs> we just saw assassination time. But, we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure out what happened. We're gonna go stop him and talk to Fen. So, make sure you guys, if you liked what you see, hit that like button. Subscribe for more content. And, thanks for watching. Kaiser Kerr out. Peace and booyah.